to the components. You don't want that. And yeah. Alright. I need to open this door back up. You know the fumes ain't gonna be that bad because it's only a little run that I gotta do. But... Very careful on not to not to spill it on my drapes or anything like that. We really wish they was out the way a little bit more, but it should be good. I gotta stick a pin in here to uh, open this up. So let me uh, get this open up and I'll be right back, gang. All right, gang, we back. We got it opened up. So once again, we're just gonna kind of get our game plan together. Put the glue on here. of it all, all the way oh that's strong that stuff is strong put it on up oh that stuff is strong Then, whew, this is strong. Shit, I don't even feel like it need that activator. Just like that, that should lock that in. Should never have to worry about that coming down again. Another little area back there that could use some attention too. Might as well do it all. There's one little part right here trying to buckle too. Right there. Little part trying to buckle, so I might as well try to tap that all the way in as well while I'm doing it, right? Do the right things right. So let me knock that out. Man, that stuff is strong. I can feel it on my my dang on finger. Jeez, it's really, really, really tacky.
sorry. Wipey wipe. Should get hot too. That shit is smoking. I'm dead ass, it get hot. I'm dead ass, it gets hot. Like hot to the touch. This shit ain't no joke. Play with. Good on that. I ain't never felt nothing like that. But yeah, we looking good now. Glad right, we did that. Yep, that was the last little area right there. That was kinda suspect. You know what, this little area right here too. It was, it was kinda looking weak. As y'all can see, came right off. In there. All right, let me check this side. This side looking relatively really good, really, really nice. One little area. Yeah, I mean, it's like a little small, little, small little shunt. But we gonna go ahead, do the right things right, and address it.
locked in here. Well, you put this shit on there, that shit over with. You ain't got to worry about nothing. That shit lock in so hard. Yeah, so. Wanted to get that done for a long time. That that was bothering me. You know, this towel is over with. This shit hard as hell. Towel is done. So this got to go straight in the garbage. But yeah. That shit on my fingers, like. Y'all can see that shit. That shit is like hard. We got all that situated. Put this back on here. Yep. Get that situated. All right, gang. Well, that's it for now. I will holla at y'all when I cut the camera back on. But yeah, man, we getting uh, Vino all the way back together, man. And uh, can't wait to get the back done <laughs> so that we can have the whole van back looking nice. Yeah. And uh, we're going to take it up from here. But I'll holla at y'all. Let's get it. All right, gang, 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 gang. Boy Stunner Reese man is headed to the other property. Gotta go grab some important documents that I need. But I want to say, man, shout out to my girl Shauna P. She has actually started uploading her YouTube content, man. Make sure y'all go subscribe to Shauna P on YouTube. She's gonna be showing y'all the car culture. She 32 gang. Shout out to her, man. She deserve it. She been going hard, going viral. You know what I'm saying? And she been putting in for the culture for a long time. A lot of people don't know people that she, you know, been into the cars. She didn't start with the two-door box. She had cars before that, prior to that. So definitely, man, she deserves everything that she is doing, man, for the culture. And I, I appreciate her for rocking out with us, rocking out with the 32 gang. And you know what I'm saying? Like, man, she one of the ones for sure, for sure. She definitely a real one, man. So. That's a good look, man. So I can't wait to go kick it with her. Not this upcoming weekend, but the following weekend, I'm going to go kick it with her, man, in Phoenix, Arizona, man. We're going to turn up. Also, if you guys didn't know, she about to be on Wild and Out as well. So I don't know when it's going to air or whatever, how that, however that go. But yeah, make sure y'all tap in with that. And I believe Moneybag Yo and Kevin Gates is going to be on that episode. So should be fun, man. Hopefully, I get an opportunity to check that out as well. And just uh, have a good time, man. Yeah. Uh, with her when I see her down in Phoenix, man. It should be a whole situation and scenario that way. Yeah. Yeah, gang. Uh, I'll holla at y'all, man. Uh, when I get over here to the other property, man. Let's get it. Yeah. Gang, 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 gang. Your boy Stunner Reese that made it over here to the other property, man. And I got to also tell y'all one other thing that I'm about to do, man. That I want to give you guys the opportunity to get in on, man. Your boy Stunner Reese is selling my original rims off of Ocean. The ones that came on it when I bought the car. These are Lexani Forge. Yes, yeah, so sir. High quality three piece rims. Yup. Lexani's. And these the forge lines. And yeah, they are for sale, man. 1000 bucks. Get you all four wheels, man. They do got the five inch lip on the back and the two and a half inch lip on the front. All the tires is good, except this one right here does leak air. Uh, I believe it could be the tire itself. Uh, yeah, it's the tire itself. You see the tire right here is, uh, yeah, got some issues. But uh, you replace this tire and you all good, man. Yeah, this one losing air. 
but all the rest of them are aired up, ready to go. Really good shape. Paint them any way you want to. You can powder coat the whole face or you could just color match the inside to the color of your car. You know what I'm saying? Or you could just do them all brush, however you want to do them, man. It's a lot of different ways you can configure the design on them. But yeah, definitely, man. A great pickup, set of 22s. Give you that nice look. The bolt pattern is for an Impala SS, uh, which also is the same for a Dunk as well. So I'm not sure the exact number that is. For those who know in the comments, y'all definitely drop it in the comments. The bolt pattern. I'll try to look it up before I leave and also post it on a video as well somewhere in here. So yeah, I'm going to try to remember to do that. But if I don't, I'm not pretty sure we got some smart guys in the comments that's going to tell y'all it's a 5x127 or 5x140. Whatever it is, they're going to let y'all know, man. Just look in the comments. Somebody going somebody gonna to know, even if I don't do it. So, yeah. But, yeah, guys, these are for sale, man. Getting rid of my, my rims, man. Getting rid of my rims. Yep. So, so anybody who want them, you can have them. I'm getting ready to go back to Miami. I ain't going to need them. I'm not going to put them on anything else. I was going to save them and possibly put them on another car, but, yeah, I mean, I'm just going a different route, guys. Because I could easily take them and powder coat the faces of these to any color of uh, any car that I get and have a nice set of wheels. But I'm going to just decide I just decided I'm going to do something different. That was my original goal. But, yeah, these rims brand new probably was up with a six dollars $7,000 easily for these Lexani forges and these are some of the best built wheels that you can get guys strong faces strong barrels very good material not like a lot of the other newer rims guys these are really really high quality high high quality yep so if you guys are interested let me know drop me a message especially go to my dm on instagram at stunner underscore reese underscore let me know you're interested in the wheels and I will definitely, uh, you know, figure something out. Hopefully, you guys are local. We can come right here in the Chicagoland area and pick them up. Because I'm going to be honest with you, probably not going to be around to be shipping them off or anything like that. So, yeah, it's pretty much for my local guys, anybody local. Now, if you want to do all the extra stuff and, you know what I'm saying, get them picked up and all that stuff, or the shipping company, they come and get them and wrap them up and all that, or you got somebody to do it for you. Yeah, but I'm not really interested in doing all of that extra stuff, so... Yeah, but uh, yeah, man, you get a chance to get an opportunity, get a, a part of Ocean, man, for a thousand bucks. A thousand bucks. All right, so yeah. So yeah, gang, that's what it is. Also, y'all see that giveaway card right here looking. Ooh, 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 ooh. So, so good. So, so good. Yeah. With the big, big choppers. Big choppers on there. Man, that's a badass car. Double roofs. Yeah. Just in case you, you don't want to open up one roof, you can open up two. Yeah. If you want to open up just the back, you can open up just the back. Hey, it's up to you, man. Rock it how you want to. All right, gang. But I'll holler at y'all in a minute, man. Appreciate y'all. Let's get it. The next day. All right, gang. Gang, 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 gang. It is the next day, man. And I got... Cuzzo here at the crib. Yes, sir. What yep, are you doing? Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, man. I got to show y'all where we at and what we got going on. Now, y'all already know that Cuzzo is working on my project for my lights, man. But I got some of the work that he done actually here in my face. I'm about to show it to y'all, man. A lot of y'all not even going to know what's going on because y'all don't know. And if I didn't tell y'all, y'all probably wouldn't know. You know what I'm saying? But... Let me show y'all what we got going on, man. Now, y'all know I've been working on these custom tail lights for Drac. I want to do some one-off tail lights for Drac that I have never seen on any other car. And we're going to try to do that with this. Yeah. Now, y'all might know that with the 2016 and up or 15 and up Dodge Challenger, the lights got like the circle around running light, the circle running light around the outside, and then just the middles 
have the light up part, you know what I'm saying? But the running light is like a constant circle, which looks really, really cool. That's one of the coolest features with the Dodge Challenger tail lights. I love that part, and I've always loved that. At one point in time, I was actually, and I am, you know, some of y'all may remember this or not, but I was talking about doing some custom tail lights uh, from another vehicle. Well, I was actually going to attempt to take some Challenger tail lights and actually implement them into Drac, onto the back of Drac, the actual lights. But it's a two-piece light. It's not like a seamless, seamless light. It would have been, I would have had to cut a whole panel up, take three pieces and cut a whole panel up, cut all kinds of stuff. It would have been like really, really difficult. But then I decided in my mind to do a custom one-off set that never been done. So as y'all seen, I went and had the Plexi made. I showed y'all the Plexi. Now I want to show y'all pretty much how Cuzzo is going to kind of assemble them and kind of like put everything together. So, yes, sir. Y'all make sure y'all go subscribe to Life With Manny and y'all gonna, gonna see the footage. Oh yeah, they can see the footage of me actually from start to finish on the light. Okay, cool, cool. Y'all gonna be able to see the, the start to finish on how this actually came together. Should with. be tomorrow. Or maybe, no, tomorrow. Okay, okay. So yeah, y'all yeah, just stick around. Stay tuned. Make sure y'all subscribe to his channel, Life With Manny. Also, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. Also, make sure y'all turn on those post notifications to all so y'all miss none of the videos. That's the most important thing. All right, but... <clears throat> so check it. What we got here is... Let me show y'all this first. These are an extra set of factory tail light bezels that I had for Drac that I was actually gifted. And uh, yeah, so uh, these are the factory tail light bezels. And I don't know if those who know, I'm gonna give y'all a little chance to look at them and uh, see if y'all could drop in the comments and tell me what's different about these over a factory tail light bezel. Tell me if y'all can tell the difference looking at them right now. And as a matter of fact, what I'm going to go do right now is I'm about to go out here and show y'all Drac. I'm going to show y'all Drac. And uh, maybe y'all can tell the difference once I show y'all Dracs. Organic bananas. Got to be organic. Y'all see that PO code? 94. Definitely make sure y'all... Bananas and fruits and vegetables start with a nine. Cause it got to be organic. All right. Here is the factory ones. Now if y'all notice, it's got these bars in the middle, man. Yeah, it's got these bars in the center to separate the three tail lights. These two are the turn signals, and this is the reverse light right here. But Cuzzo actually took out all of the center bars, which is all metal, all of this metal, sanded it down, grinded it down so it looks like a factory one piece instead of a two piece. So, yeah. So, with that being said. that being said now it's going to kind of mimic the challenger because the challenger doesn't have any bars in the center that look ugly so yeah why should we so Cuzzo actually cut that down filled it in and got it looking beautiful yeah so now with that being said, we are going to take these LED strips and we are going to put them on the inside of the tail lights. Once the tail lights are tinted black, and it's going to follow that line around and give a similar look. It's going to follow that line around and give a similar look to 
the challenger lights and then the actual brake lights will still light up in the center but it's going you know when the running lights is on it's going to have that red glow going around the back which is going to be a one off piece yeah one off no, no one has ever done that before no one so with that being said Ha, ha, ha. Yeah, we got something special coming. We got something super special coming. So, yeah. Excited about that. Super excited about that. And, uh, man, I can't wait. Can't wait. So, we got to get these painted. So, we're going to drop these off to my boy Chris today. And he's going to get them painted up. And then they're going to go back to Manny. What the hell? Yeah. We're going to get them painted up and they're going to come back to Manny and he's going to actually, you know, put them together, assemble them. He's got wire. He's going to wire them up and everything. And yeah. So, yeah, y'all, y'all stick around. Stay tuned for that. This shouldn't take too, too much, no time to get this stuff painted. Chris going to knock this right out. So, yeah. But yeah, gang, that's where we at. So drop in the comments. Tell me what y'all think. Uh, and yeah, man, tell me what y'all think, how y'all think it's going to look. I think it's going to be really, really cool, unique look and something that I ain't got to worry about ever rolling up on the side of somebody else and seeing again, man, that one off custom touch. Yeah, 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 yeah. But look at the body work he did on it, man. Smooth it out. Now, the original ones was before he actually took them apart, they was all pitted up from all the chrome and everything. He primed them up and everything, got them all ready for paint. Looking real, real good, man. And he got a big project that he about to be doing. Y'all got to go see on his uh, channel, man. A big project. And it's going to be the first time doing it, doing it too, right? Uh, By myself, yeah. By yourself, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 So, yeah, y'all definitely got to tune in for that. That's going to be crazy, crazy, crazy. So, yeah. But yeah, well, guys, with that being of, said, of that big, I've done it with smaller projects, yeah, yeah, bikes yeah. and pieces. Yeah, yeah, not first, yeah, yeah. So yeah, y'all, you know, in order for that, I don't know if you want to tell them or you know, what I'm saying. They, uh, I can tell them. Yeah, okay. I'm uh, painting uh, my son's uh, Toyota Prius, and it's gonna be uh, a nice pearl color. It's going to be real nice. I ain't going to reveal the color mm -hmm. just yet. Y'all yeah. just got to tune in to see the color, but it's going to be dope. Yeah, so it's going to be his first time actually painting the car. Mm -hmm. You know, he's going to be paint. He primed it, painted. He just went through everything, blocking it, body all work. All the body every, work's done. All yeah. the body work. Dent removal. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. right. Yeah, I'm just saying. smashed in on one side. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, y'all going to have to definitely uh, tap in, tune in with him to see that. You know what I'm saying? I'm excited to see him dump, you know, like really, really getting involved with this custom, custom work, you know what I'm saying, to this level on, on many different levels. I mean, he, he, you know, is planning on being a one man shop. One, not one, one man, stop, one stop, one stop, one stop shop. shop. Yeah. yeah. Ain't gonna care myself. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> a do, one stop shop. I do one car, yeah. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, no, but you know, like, uh, like I've said before on my channel, mm -hmm. to those that have been on my channel. Uh, all this stuff I've been kind of doing all my life, mm -hmm. as long as I can remember. You right. know what I'm saying? With me having 10 uncles that were doing different things, mm -hmm. I always had to help on many different areas. Right. You know what I'm right. saying? Not only that, the things that we started doing yeah. together, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, it just all adds to it. It yeah. just was, you know, building up the, the storage and the knowledge in my head. Mm -hmm. It's just for this project, I never actually took on the whole job. By yourself. It yeah. was always someone there. Right. And it was kind of, most of the time, I was someone there that had more knowledge than me. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But when you know, you know. And I, I, I mean, I'm more mentally in my own way versus not knowing how to do it. I know how to do it, but right. mentally in my own way, like, uh, am I going to do it right? You know what I mean? Right, gotcha. But it's going to get done. Definitely. Real soon. Definitely. So, yeah, man, y'all stick around. Stay tuned for that. That's going to be dope. I can't wait to see what Cuzzo do in reference to that, man. For sure, for sure. But, yeah, gang, uh, we about to go. I got to hit up Chris and uh, see if he's available so I can drop this, this off to him. And I got to make a quick stop at the mall. I'm 
man, I got to admit, man, the same chain that my 32 gang pendant fell off of, the class broke again. So I got to go take it and get the class broke, I mean, fixed again because I almost lost my number one stunner charm because of the class broke again, just like I bought, lost my 32 gang pendant. So, yeah, I'm, I might have, good, yeah, yeah, I already lost the 32 gang pendant and then I almost lost. Heavy duty class. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to have to get a, a, a different class, so. Yep, so I got to go take that and get that done real quick. And then also, man, today, man, we got a special set of wheels for a special set of, well, a special set of, for a special car coming in today, too, man. Ooh, 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 can y'all think what car it could possibly be? Y'all drop in the comments, let me know what car could possibly get in, be getting a set of wheels, man. Oh, 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 today. Yep. So thank God for everything that, you know, he blessed me with, man. Thank God for all of you guys. I appreciate all the support. You know, definitely, man, if y'all haven't subscribed to the channel, man, make sure y'all tap in with the realest dude on YouTube. That's right, man. I show you all my real life every single day. No fake, no phony, you know, and man, I'm just grateful, man. Appreciate y'all. Definitely make sure you hit that subscribe button. And also, make sure you turn those post notifications off so you don't miss none of these videos. And also, don't forget, man, hit that like button. Hit that like button. We're trying to get to a thousand likes per video. Also, make sure you drop a comment as well, man. If you uh, made it to this part of the video, make sure you drop in the comments, man. I am a real one because I need to know my real ones were still with me. You feel me? And uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, man, I got a lot of big blessings in my life, man, right now that's uh, really taking me to the next level. And I can't wait to share it all with y'all, man. You know, we're going to be going to uh, Atlanta on October 12th and 13th. On October 12th, I'm going to be going to check out the Box Chevy show, the Boxtober Fest. And then on that Saturday, my brother Sin Whip Addict, man, I'll be at his show, man, the Whip Addict show as well. Uh, if you guys want to see me, I'm on the flyer for that event. It's on my Instagram. Make sure you guys go and follow my Instagram, stunner underscore Reese underscore. That's my only Instagram. All those other Instagrams is fake. They is not me. I only got one Instagram for my personal page. I do have a Galati Black clothing brand merch, and I also have a uh, Galati, Galati Black clothing brand Instagram, and I also have my Schoolie Boys car page as well, man. So those two are mine as well. But all those other Stunner Reese's, none of those are mine. So yeah, make sure y'all go uh, follow me on all those platforms as well, man. And also, don't forget, check me out on my official Facebook group. Got 96,000 followers, uh, subscribers, and counting. Uh, that is Street Whip Stunt, man. So make sure y'all go check me out on Street Whip Stunt Facebook group. 96K, man. We almost uh, at that 100K on that, man. So yeah, definitely need 4,000 of y'all watching the video to go follow my Facebook group, Street Whip whip stunt let's get that to 100k all right but yeah man that's what it is man i will um man i'm excited about the vns bill like i told y'all man he gonna be doing some work on that as well we got some, uh, some really really special stuff that we've been talking about and planning he's been showing me some stuff we've been bouncing ideas off of one another so that's gonna be dope um everybody who's working on the car a part of the car a part of the bill uh, seem like they're excited. Risk Rocks Car Show IG has been definitely tuned in, commenting on everything that I've been posting about the car. So, you know, it's just it's just all, you know, blessings, blessings, blessings. So I'm excited. Also, Nava's event, um, the Florida Fest, uh, I tapped in with that. I think I spoke about that a little bit, but I tapped in with that. I got a response to them in reference to um, the packages that they offer. They offer a VIP package where you're close to the stage and at the show, they're going to have Bossman D-Lo and a bunch of other people performing. Uh, and then they got another part of the show, which is the general area where, you know what I'm saying, um, you can you can go to, to that area too. So it's all about what you want to do. If you want to pay them more for the VIP area close to the stage or if you want to 
be in the general area, you know. So, yeah. So, with that being said, man, y'all stick around. Stay tuned. Um, yeah, man, for all of the tours because I'll be in St. Louis Saturday. I might be in Memphis on Sunday. So, I might leave from St. Louis on Saturday and go straight to Memphis because it's another big car show in Memphis on Sunday. So, I'm, you know, I might be doing that. And then y'all know the following weekend is me. Uh, Cuzzo, Shauna P, man, in Phoenix, Arizona. And then the weekend after that uh, is Whip Attic and the Box Heavy Straws or something y'all about. So, yeah, that's what it is, man. So, got a lot of stuff in the works. Got a lot of stuff in the plans. A little, little major, little tour about to happen, which I'm going to be still going every weekend. Then, of course, y'all know I still got to go back to the yams, too, man. Still got to make it back to the yams. So, yep, but... uh. I will holler at y'all, man. Let me get my ugly ass up out of here so I can get some work done. Let's go. All right, gang, 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 man. Your boy Stunner Reese and Kazo, man, just came from dropping off the parts over there to my boy Chris, man. He said he can have that shit done tonight. Yes. And my little cousin Dig just found a new door for the back of Vino, just in case y'all didn't see the video. And y'all new to the channel, man. Your boy Stunner Reese, man. Destroyed my van. Yeah, I destroyed it. And we got this big ugly crease right here so little cuz just found a new door so he picking it up now so we'll be able to just swap the door and uh, actually paint the door the new door and that's it um, gonna have to figure out how to take this one out flower was saying there's something about a pen <coughs> Hey, Cuzzo. Do you unbolt this? Wait a minute. No. Did this just come off of here? Off of this hinge? Let me see. Let me look at it real. Got four bolts. Got four bolts right here holding this bracket on. But these screws right here probably will uncover this. And these two right here, these three, or no, these rivets. Yeah, so they ain't gonna rivets. come off. This is for this cap. Okay. So. This is on the swivel. Which it probably fall out. Probably take this and it probably come down. Them four bolts, probably. I'm guessing. Oh. I'm thinking them four bolts. Well, we gonna have to YouTube that problem. Yeah, this ain't nothing but on the swivel. Yeah. So this gonna fall out for sure. Oh, uh, okay. You see what I'm saying? It's on the pin. So if not, you have to take this light out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Let me see. Swivel it. Swivel it. It's on the swivel. Oh, the swivel is back there. Yeah. This is the swivel back yeah. there. Mm -hmm. This and ain't nothing but a stop. It's, it's a, a cap right there. What is that right there? That little cap in there. Oh, you see that? See in there? That's not holding the top of it, is it? Yeah, that's probably a pin. So, yeah, he probably going to probably take this light out. Which, to take the light out. Yeah, to take the light out, you got to take this cap out because I had these tenant. Yeah, yeah, you gotta take this off too, right? Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah. take, you gotta take both take. of these off. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta take both of them off. And if you take that pin out, the door probably come up off of that pin. Oh, so it's a pin down here too. It's gotta be a pin. Oh, right here. Yeah, it's gotta be a That's pin. what you're talking about? Yeah, watch your finger. Look, no, keep looking at it. Go ahead. It's gotta be on the pin. You look at it. All these you pin doors it. on pins. Yeah, it's on a pin. Is that what it is? Yeah. Mm hmm Okay. Yeah, so to get that top one, you're gonna have to take these two off, and then that pin may come up. Okay. I've never done it. If, you know, on the, on, on the old vans, they was out here. 
Right. Just knock the heat. Yeah. Knock the pin up. up. Yeah. Yeah. So oh, yeah. Dig, dig gonna know how to take it on and off by the time he leave there. Trust me. I already know. Oh, he gonna assess it. I already know. And then he just gotta swap this this little panel over in mm -hmm. the rear view camera. Yeah. Yeah, he uh he gonna, he gonna figure, figure it out. out. Oh, I know he's gonna figure it out. Hey now. <laughs> oh, and this little pop out window. So yeah, this look like all you need to do is take these out to put the pop out window in there. Okay, so yeah, I might be able to put my original glass back in there. Uh, all right, well, yeah, guys, we are uh, getting this situated as well. few moments later all right gang 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 man it is time it is time it is time i got my brother doula here the motherfucking wheel king y'all know who it is man what's going on guys flush not rushed yeah flush not rush oh 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 gang 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 Ooh-wee, we finna hurt some feelings. We finna hurt some feelings. Bro, that was an excellent choice. Find the best one you can that was an excellent not... choice. Dude, what it do, sir? What's going on, man? Yeah, I'm happy I talked to you today. Yeah, else. yeah. So listen, I was gonna do something different. He was like, nah, I got the perfect wheel, but he showed it to me. I was like, yeah, that's gonna be special. Definitely gonna be so special. So yeah, gang, uh, y'all just stick around, stay tuned, man. We're gonna pull these things out. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna show y'all the wheels, man. I'm gonna show y'all the wheels. I know y'all ready, I know y'all anxious. Y'all already know. Yep, and up, up next, man, we we, we boating up uh, Drac, man, with some billets. So that's next, that's next. So yeah, but I'll holler at y'all in a minute, man. Let me get these sit y'all holler. All right, gang, 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 man. It is time. It is time. It is time. Now, I know y'all want to see the wheel, man. I know y'all want to see the wheel, man. And, guys, check this out, man. Your boy, Stunna Reese, definitely is about to show you the wheel, all right? But, uh, man, y'all, first of all, before I show y'all the wheel, I want to show y'all the tires. Hold on, let me make sure. Show y'all the tires. Y'all see them ties right there? Yes, yeah, sir. Y'all see them ties right there? Mm-hmm. 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 I want to show y'all that before I show y'all the wheel. All right? <laughs> boom, boom, boom. Yes, sir. 26s. 26s. Yes, we went 26s on VNS. All right? Now, I want to show y'all something else. The key? Yep. Candy store for Christmas. Da, 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 da. Y'all already know, man. Going with my goal. Y'all already know. Well, y'all can tell that because a lot of y'all on IG follow my IG. Y'all know that I got the gold accessories and stuff. 
and things like that already came in for the car. So y'all know, you know what I'm saying, to some extent, y'all already knew that part. So I'm, I, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna really trip and tweak on y'all too tough, all right? Let's see, hold on, see. It's all the way down. Oh, uh, no, hold on. There you go. All right, so that being said, let me show y'all Are y'all ready? Are y'all ready? Hold on. Ooh, that's like opening up a pizza box, boy. Mm, 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 mm. All right, here we go. You know, I gotta give y'all the whole feel. I can't deprive y'all of nothing. I promised y'all I was going to show y'all the wheel. Boom! <laughs> there it is. There it is, man. What y'all think, gang? Nasty. Yes, sir. Yeah, there it go, man. That's like holding a brick of gold right there. Yes, sir. Y'all already know what it is. Then we got, of course, the leather wrap. I got to drop this off today so he can wrap it the same color as the interior. In the box. The last time my screws came up missing, well, not remember, I don't know if y'all remember, but remember, I couldn't even find the whole damn steering wheel for a while, but my brother Rick ended up having the steering wheel for uh, ski mask. So yeah, mm -hmm. so yeah. But yeah, we got the steering wheel this time. I'm gonna make sure I know where the damn steering wheel at. Make but sure yeah, we gotta keep, keep this way. ring right here. And we're gonna have Dave to wrap this ring the same color as the interior. So it had that whole flow, you feel me? Yeah, with that ultra leather, yeah. Yeah, not vinyl, ultra leather. Yeah, ultra leather through everything. Yeah, so we're gonna get that matched up as well. We're gonna have that real good look to it. You feel me? Now, I know y'all still wondering what color I'm doing the interior and all that. Well, with me telling y'all that I'm changing this color, y'all know the interior ain't going to be black. That's one thing for sure. But look at that, y'all. Look at that. Shout out your boy coming down Ocean Drive like, uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh. Yeah, that way. That's perfect. That's perfect. Look, cuz old found the uh, door. Hold on. Is that it? Yeah. Can we, I can show it to you. Yeah. All right, y'all. Cuz old found the door. There it is right there. So we got the door. The door is valid. Perfect. Exactly what I need. Yeah, he went through like four doors and they, they all had little rust or little stuff. I said, no. Found a perfect one. Don't leave that till you find one. Okay, okay. Found one. Dude, is that stripe? Is that stripe just uh it's a, that's stripe you get took off. Go well, off, cool. off and buff it off. Okay. Yeah, dude, dude can take that Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, was, that's minimal. Yep, yep. Ain't got no, so we ain't no damage on it, though. Right, right. No, we didn't want no damage. Yeah, that's, that's very minimal. Yeah, that's very minimal. So, yeah, gang, so y'all seen the wheel. Y'all seen the wheel. Now, 
I got a question. I got a question. Are y'all ready to see the wheels? Are y'all ready to see the wheels? Put a little other steering part for the steering column. back in this box so we ain't missing nothing ain't nothing coming up missing we ain't got no excuses we don't want no excuses no excuses zero excuses so yeah y'all see the steering column part and of course the horn shows all that Now, are y'all ready to see the wheels? Yeah, I know y'all are. All right, get ready to see the wheels going down in three, two, one. Let's go. You are checking out the Galati Black Collection. It is the luxury trapper apparel. Trapper means take risk and prosper. This is a streetwear brand. This is a street fashion brand. Built for any occasions, clubs, parties. We got many different styles to choose from. Make sure you go and grab your Galati Black apparel today. Visit us at www.stunnerysent.com. When y'all need streets, you want to stay dangerous. Make sure you do it with Galati Black. Make sure you click the link in the description and grab yours today. You will be entered to win a round trip ticket and a hotel stay to hang out with Stunner Reese on New Year's Eve with any Kaladi Black purchase. guys today's video is brought to you by yantu the a22 tire inflator this is a portable unit that you can keep right in your car and guys i'm going to show you guys just how easy it is to use this product so yes we're going to go through the full unboxing it's as simple as that it comes in a nice carrying case to hold inside with the Yantu brand on it. Has the nice zipper compartments where you can unzip it to keep your Yantu tire inflator stored properly. We also have a nice protective plastic covering over it when it comes in shipping to protect it from getting scratched up or anything. Now, this is a nice sturdy unit. You can tell that it's built from quality and it is great for these emergency instances if you need to inflate your tire on your car rather quickly. It also comes with the other accessories you will need as far as your power cord, your actual inflator cord. It has a USB charging port where you can charge it actually in your car. And it actually has all the accessories to even inflate balls. Also, you can inflate different things that you may need like inflatables. And it even comes with spare fuses. So yes, everything is included in the kit. I'm gonna show you guys just how simple it is to actually hook it up if you wanted to install air into your tire. It is a real easy process that is as easy as one, two, three. And we're gonna demonstrate it right here on this beautiful Acura TLX. Simply take your end, and it's actually the same on both sides. You stick that on the valve stem as if it was your tire and pull the lever down just like that to insert the cord onto the inflator. Then you take the identical end, which is just like the other side, and you take that and put it on the valve stem of your car. Now guys, 
simply on the power the unit on by pressing the button on the side here it'll tell you by the digital display right on the screen that the pounds are at the current level but it is fully adjustable you can adjust the pounds that you want to go into the tire by simply pressing the button and it will display the pounds that you want on the screen then you simply hit the power button and it will go to that amount of air pressure that you have desired now the other good thing is that it is cordless and you don't have to plug it into a cigarette lighter you can simply just hit the button and it'll air it up it is currently set to 36 pounds so once it gets to the amount that is set for it will automatically shut down so you do not over inflate your tires that's one of the best things about this Yantu tire inflator if you want to charge it you have the ability to charge it at home you can charge it in a car it has all the functions that you need and that's right if you want to grab you one today make sure you click the link in the description of this video and grab you one now nice easy affordable and guys it is definitely portable so definitely go ahead grab you a yantu tire inflator today that's right man and make sure you let them know stunner reese sent you let's get it yeah subscribe to stunner reese and put on your post notification Oh. oh, perfect oh. match, bro. Bro, that's the <laughs> one. Oh. All the different Mexican colors, too. Just depends on how you're feeling. Yeah. You can even do pink for Valentine's Day. It's coming up. <laughs> that's different. Couple bolts. Plug it in. Plug and play. Super simple. Running the rest like I want them. Counting the rest like I want them. Carrots, I want them.